I am. I'm a U.S. Air Force Major General, and uh, my background is in C-130s. Uh, so I spent my operational career flying uh, C-130s and airdrop missions. One of my responsibilities is to be involved with all of our member countries. We have responsibility for 51 countries in Europe. The European Command is headquartered at Stuttgart, Germany, and uh, so we have been there uh, since World War II, uh, and we're the only combatant command that is permanently stationed outside the United States. I think it has to be the opportunity as you, as you grow older, but I even remember when I was younger, the opportunity to interact with other military forces and to learn from them and their experiences. Um, a, as we get to stay longer, uh, as you get promoted, that just continues and becomes richer and richer. So our, our bilateral relationship is long and very important. and. Um, Military to military, we've shared continuously off and on uh, for my adult life. And, and that's significant um, because some of our partners are much newer than that. And so our old partners are people that we really have deep trust in. And uh, so we really appreciate um, the solidarity of Austria as a country and the values that it stands for. We share the same values, and that's part of what we think the, the key bond between the United States and most of the European countries is our shared values. We got our values in America from Europeans, and so uh, we appreciate that, and that's why we can agree on so much at the outset, and uh, the rest of it becomes fairly easy. I, I'm really impressed with, uh, although Austria uh, by definition is a small geographic country, they make a big uh, uh, difference um, in security matters. and. While many countries in Europe and the United States are concerned and involved in Afghanistan, um, equally important are some of the, the challenges that exist right here in this part of the neighborhood, uh, places like Kosovo and Bosnia-Herzegovina. Um, I've visited both those places. I can tell you that the, the countries that contribute there, like Austria does, uh, about 1,500 forces outside the borders of Austria, hugely appreciated because those are forces that uh, provide security and provide stability that we don't take for granted. Uh, and those are forces that some other country uh, either can't or doesn't have to provide. So we're very appreciative to know that they're there and they're very good at what they do. Very professional military.